and Michael thinks I'm making the biggest mistake of my life. Maybe I am, um, but it'll be my mistake to make. You know, my mother used to say, don't be afraid to fail. Be afraid not to try. Hmm. never stop trying. But I, I respect your boundaries today. Of acting the role of Tony's stupid wife. Protecting Tony's identity. Even when my brother was in danger of getting caught and everyone told me to give him up. You've got to eat something. Leave me alone, David! What is this going to do? Is the food going to bring back my baby? Is it? I don't think eating is going to heal my pain. God. You and your family killed my baby, David. You killed your unborn child. Shut up. I hope to God you never get any peaceful sleep for the rest of your miserable life, David. Get out. Out, David. I said get out. Get out of here. Go. Hello? Belinda, your time is up. You bring Alice to see me today or I'm telling your husband all about us. You hear me? If you think I'm playing, listen to this. So, I marry David only for his money. When I have gathered enough money, you and I can live happily ever. You have two hours. Bring her or we are done. I have decided to leave everything and everyone for a fresh start somewhere else. Gosh, you look beautiful. I realized I've been going about this the wrong way. Axum is something you really want to do and I should support you. Just like you've done with everything else. No long talk, just us here in the moment. Go back again for God knows how long. I mean, this could be forever. What if you... What? What if... What? Why don't you say it, Michael? What if you end up doing it with Patrick instead? What kind of girl do you think I am? <laughs> well, I have news for you, Patrick. You pay for your sins today. You're free, Patrick. You have just two choices. You take back your words and make good with her, or you face the wrath of a guy who has had enough. Mm. Go for it. Go for it. Gosh. My friend. Who are you? I told you I'm the guy no one misses. <laughs> Mm-hmm. <clears throat>